Got this uh, nice coon here again, setting up trails. They're walking across and produce. We'll get them taken care of. All right, so we got a coon right there, and a dog proof. And see, faint trail right there. So we're setting with all these small game trails. And I come over here. We got a coon there. That was a uh, deer hole set, so one and a half garden it. So uh, we'll call that one a double. And uh, you know these game trails, they uh, especially these small game trails, they really do produce. So until next time. All right, real windy day, real cold. Uh, we had a rain, temperatures dropping, and uh, picked up this nice coon here, right on a a uh, it's a cow trail going through. You can see the cow trail. Had a one and a half on a dirt hole. So here we are. Getting taken care of. Moving on. Alright, guys. Huh? That's why I say set doubles. Uh, set the high bank and the low bank here. We've got the high bank of the creek set. Got a coon in. And then right there. Set the uh, set the low bank. And got the coon in. So uh, anyway, that's a good double. We'll get them taken out of and uh, moving on. All right. All right, guys, got another nice coon here. Uh, it's just nothing but a game trail set here. Uh, I've taken, uh, this is the fifth coon I've taken off in four days. I've got two dog proof set, fifth coon in four days. That's why I say set these game trails and they run them. We'll get them taken care of and uh, move on. So I get a lot of questions uh, about what's a coon trail. You know, what, well, you can see right there going into that Milo field. It just rained last night and it's showing up real well. That nice thin trail there, that is a small game trail. And, uh, you know, that's what them coons travel. So, anyway, that's that. All right, guys, so I, uh, I showed you the trail leading into this Milo field. Got a nice muddy coon right there. Nice muddy coon right there. So uh, anyway, sets do pay off. Get them going to the grocery store. All right. Another big old muddy coon here. It just won't stop raining, but still catching a few. They will move in the rain. All right. Got another nice coon. Coon got nice color on. Her. Here in a small game trail. Uh, get him taken care of. Alright, had this, uh, well, this was a little game trail going through the tall grass. You can see he's got the grass all torn down, but uh, DP right in front of him. You can see there's the old mud line right there where the, uh, the trail was. Nice big old coon. Alright, so uh, this was a, a dirt hole type set here with a, a one and a half garden it you can see one and a half double jaw front foot catch it was uh it got down to 14 degrees last night and you can tell with that double jaw coon didn't chew at all so uh you know good sized trap big old coon we'll get this reset here and move on got another big boar coon here uh and a dog proof here set on set on sign uh, it's getting about that time of year, guys. The uh, the rut's starting, so uh, get out there, uh, set on signs, set for them big boars, and uh, we'll get this guy taken care of. And move it on. All right, guys. Uh, sitting here in my truck. It's real windy outside, so I'm gonna stay in here. But uh, anyway, here's a there's a nice coyote here. Uh, you can see from a little bit of snow, we went from rain, inch and a half of rain one day to uh, Right now it's seven degrees with a wind chill of minus 12. So a uh, pretty dramatic temperature change. But uh, anyway, those coyotes, they really got to move whenever it gets cold. So, uh, you know, start chiseling in that ground. We've got frozen solid ground. But uh, I like using scent post sets here because you can't dig no dirt hole. But uh, anyway, you can see it produced a 
well, what we get here, red coyotes. But uh, anyway, another nice coyote, deer killer down. We'll get him taken care of and uh, we'll move on. All right, guys. So uh, anyway, that was uh, that was that was that week there. Tough week, real tough week. Uh, had rain and then it froze. I mean, we had minus zero temperatures there. I think it got down to minus four, minus five a couple nights. And then it warmed back up and it was just not real good. But uh, anyway, struggled through it. Ended up with uh, there's 32 coons there. Uh, three possums and then uh, one coyote back there. So uh, anyway, it wasn't the best week by far, but uh, you know we've got another another big week coming up here. It'd be a, supposed to be a little bit of a warm up. Uh, so anyway, that's kind of a scan there of uh, so far. And then we've got this. So uh, hopefully next week will be better. We'll see you guys then.